John 12 to her friend who has been bedridden for many years. Look for them, find them. They are everywhere. Not only just needy that you can find a home, or a widow you can find a home, there are many of them you cannot find a home. They are in the hospital where they are being treated. Many of them will be there permanently. That has been their home. So you should have their number. Wake up in the morning, hello, how are you doing? I just want to know how you are doing there. Is there anything you want me to bring for you? Many of them, their parents have abandoned them for many years. They have abandoned them and they will never have their, their parents, their, their family anymore. Be their family. The huge meeting in Nazareth. This is just our preparation, our hearts. So please, over to you. A big opportunity for you to go out there, look for those who are on the seabed, who have been bedridden for many years. If they don't have answer, you can get one for them and give them a phone call. Send your children, let your children know you with that habit. That is weird. So that they can continue when you are no longer live. I still remember the habit I took from my mom in those days when I was in school, primary school. Anytime I'm coming back from school, I have to meet my mommy somewhere where she's praying. In the farm, in the wilderness, in the mountain, I have to go there with school uniform. Meeting my mommy sitting down, mommy will bring food from home, keeping that food waiting for me. I got used to that. That prayer is a key, is a master key. So your children too, it is time now to give them a, a divine legacy. Thereby, your children can be looking for those who need their help. There are many, many, many all over the world. Look for them. This is the, this is opportunity for you. Over to you. Thank you.